is in full swing, but we have Colton and Pandias who are taking a break from their studies over there at Appleton West High School to come join us in the kitchen. We also have their teacher, Mrs. Carlberg. They're showing us a recipe they learned in class. Good morning, everyone. Good, Good morning. morning. Now, what are we making here this morning? Uh, we are actually making baby apple pies. Okay. All right. So that we uh, learned in class. Okay. So. How do we start? So um, what we do is we um, take the flour in. How much flour? Uh, two Maybe. and a half cups. Okay. Come on. <laughs> Got to get it all in there. There we there go. Enough. Okay. Oh, and good. then a half a teaspoon of salt. Okay. And then two sticks of butter, which equals a cup that's cut up. Mm -hmm. Oh boy. And why do we chill that, guys? Why does it need to be cold? So that it's not sticky and so it's firm. Mm -hmm. And right. then we use the wire was okay because it's faster. <laughs> now we just whisk it up for how yep. long? Would you say? About thirty seconds. Yeah. Okay. Easy Just enough. Just about like 30 seconds, maybe longer if you need to. Mm -hmm. So. All right, and we also have some other things here. I'm guessing these are apples. Yep. Okay. And this is the mixture. Mixture of. The filling. Okay. Okay. So. Now so this is, yep. after this is, combined, it look like this, and then you want to add four ta tablespoons of water and then ice cold water at a time. Okay. More if needed. So. Mhm. Mm and then it look like this, but you don't want to over mix it. You want to see the fat in it. Oh, okay. So you guys did a little TV magic for us here. You have it in staffs. <laughs> yeah. yeah. Okay. What next? So Colton will show you. Yeah. Mm -hmm. And uh, while I'm doing this, Tendius yeah. is going to be mixing the um, stuff for the filling. Okay. Oh, that looks delicious. Now, Mrs. Carlberg, this is a recipe they've learned in their advanced food class, and they're Correct. actually prepping for a little competition, I hear. Right, right. We're going to compete this year in the Fox Valley Tech High School Throwdown. And so the advanced food students are working on recipes that they can make really quick in a stressful situation. So <laughs> we've been practicing our skills with that. And you have already, students have already actually learned a few recipes in class. We have. We've already made salsa and we sold that to the staff. Ooh. And we also took advantage of the zucchini and made a chocolate zucchini cake. So. That sounds delicious. Mm -hmm. yeah. You two, what are your favorite recipes you've learned so far? Um, so <laughs> far, this so, the, the so far. Yeah, okay. All right. Now, okay, next step. Are we ready for the next one? Yep. yep. So in this bowl, I have one apple, one fourth of brown sugar, mm -hmm. two tablespoons of flour, and that'll be, that's it. Okay. Mm -hmm. Mix it up. Yeah. Smells good. Looks delicious. So you want to just put, we're going to make six of them, so you want to put them in the middle. Okay. Put them in the middle there. And so now after that, do you cut them up and you fold them together? How does that work? I'm going to actually put the other sheet. Oh, there's another sheet right here. Yeah. Okay. Why don't you just go ahead and put that on? We can pretend that we had done this. <laughs> <and, laughs> <laughs> since time's getting short. So now, is this the final product over here? Yes. It is. Yeah. That is the actual mm -hmm. final project. Okay. Product. How long does it have to bake for? About 20 to 25 minutes. Yeah. Mm -hmm. Not bad. Mm -hmm. And you've got a great fall treat. I love it. Mm -hmm. You guys, thank you so much for coming in this morning. Just head to our website, fox11online.com, for the recipe. Looks delicious. You guys should probably get back to studying. So, good day, Wisconsin. We'll be right back. Thank you.